everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome to episode 37 of HuddleCam HD Live. Today we're talking about a very interesting uh, 3D rendering mock-up I have behind me. It's going to help me explain how to install video conferencing. We're trying to make it as easy as possible. Um, if you've been watching any of our latest videos, you know that we are showing off our new Team and Team Plus video collaboration systems, which are complete turnkey, do-it-yourself, install-yourself video conferencing kits where you can install any video conferencing collaboration software. And you can kind of see behind me, we're going to zoom into all the parts and pieces, show you exactly how it works, show you exactly how it's installed, and talk about why they've been designed the way they are and uh, why they work with every video conferencing collaboration solution from Dropbox to Slack to Skype for Teams to WebEx to GoToMeeting to BlueJeans. All of them work because it's PC-based. In fact, you can see the little Intel Nook behind me there. It's uh, the key po portion of this of this system. So before I go too far, let me just briefly uh, mention our our kind of our uh, what we do every week, which is we donate to charity. So we donate twenty dollars every single week, and then if you like this video, subscribe during this week. We add additional dollars to our donation to our local CASA, the Court Appointed Special Advocacy Systems for Children, where it helps children get adopted. So it's a really wonderful cause, but let's jump right into our video here, and I'm going to explain what's going on here. Um, so basically, we've got three rooms we're going to look at today. We're going to look at a huddle room. We are going to look at a standard conference room, kind of a middle middle sized conference room, and we're going to look at a larger training room slash boardroom. So let's take a look at the huddle room first, and this is our team kit. Okay, the Huddle Cam HD Team Collaboration System. It has a wireless Huddle Pod Air. That's a wireless speakerphone you can see there on the table that just plugs in USB 2.0 to um, the Intel Nook that you'll see in a moment here. So it makes it, you couldn't, really couldn't be easier than this for installation. So let's really quickly take a look at our homepage here. Um, you can see here that I just went from here to video collaboration solutions. Here it is here, MSRP of 2399 and it, this is what it includes. We're going to go over all the different pieces, but everything you need to set up a cloud-based video conferencing system for just a little bit over $2,000. So you really can't beat it um, pricing-wise. Super easy to install, and that's what we're going over today in this in this 3D mock-up. Now, this, these 3D mock-ups, we can help you create custom 3D mock-ups for your rooms. So if you're interested in learning how to do this, use this, we can help you. We can mock up your room, your custom room for you, and show you what it's going to look like. Um, here's the Intel Nook here, and as you can see, there's two USB 3.0 ports on the back. There's also two on the front, and there's an HDMI and a DVI. Now, just for ease of use, uh, we're assuming that you're going to take that HDMI and you're just going to plug that right in to uh, your your display there to give you a really easy um, connection for video to your display. So that's that makes it really really easy. Um, you can I would highly suggest plugging this also into the network. So you're going to plug that right into the network and get a high quality internet connection. And um, this is really the heart of the system. Um, you can see it's mounted right behind the display and um, it's, it comes with a wall mount. So this is what we usually suggest. You just you wall mount it right to the display. I will show you how that works. In fact, now that we've kind of looked at the basis of this room, let me just zoom over here and show you the other side of this Intel Nook. And also, you can see the camera there with the wall mount. Let's take a look at the other side of this Intel Nook just so you can see there are two additional USB ports that we can use uh, for a keyboard and mouse that's included and a few other uh, USB options that we'll probably be taking advantage of. Now let's go ahead and watch uh, one of our installers here at HuddleCam HD install this system. So he's starting with the wall mount and I have this sped up about 200 or 300% so don't worry, he'll go, he'll go really quickly. Um, he mounts, first of all, the display and the display mount are not included with our kit. So that's the only thing that you need to have already or you need to go to Best Buy and pick up. 
Everything else is included for your video collaboration system. And we do that because so many people already have displays at their disposal. So you can see here, he's uh, he just installed the wall mount and he leveled it out. Now he's installing that plate I was talking about for the Intel Nook. Um, we can just go ahead and slip the Intel Nook on there. It has two little um, ports on the side. You can see he just slips it right on there for a secure mount and easy access to the on-off button if you ever need it. He went ahead and plugged in the wireless receiver for the HuddlePod Air, which makes our lives uh, very easy because we can now um, simply wirelessly, without having to run any cables over the floor or anything, plug our um, HuddlePod Air just into power is all it needs. And that wireless transmission to the computer makes it really, really nice. Now the next thing we have here is um, he's running the USB cable from the Intel NUC you know, that we looked at there. In fact, if I fade it over, you can see right there, those USB ports, that's where we're going to plug in. He just plugged in the HuddlePod and this, this USB cable for the camera. And you can see he's placing the camera on that wall mount there. And he's just looping the, the cables together, making sure that everything is in line there. And once that's done, you basically put the display on the wall and plug everything in. That, that's really, it's, it's, it's as easy as that. Very, very simplistic, easy to use. So there's our Nook, the heart of our video collaboration system. There's our HuddlePod Air, our wireless speakerphone. And then let's take a second to just think about this um, dashboard here we'll talk about in a moment. This is called Quick Lunch. It is included with um, each system. So I will show you that in a little more detail when we look at the next system here. Um, in fact, let's look at it just about see it see it there where you have all your collaboration stuff let me show this in a little more detail here so this includes a designer mode it's called quick launch and it allows you to very easily put all the video conference and collaboration software that you want your team to have access to in a very easy touch screen style one click launch style uh, thing here so you've got your collaboration software you've got your camera control maybe your wireless presentation with Intel Unite it's absolutely free with our kits. And then you've got your applications for Internet Explorer, Google Hangouts, you know, um, PowerPoint, Excel, stuff like that. And then don't forget that reset room button. That's really, really nice for, you know, uh, resetting the room, deleting any cache files, deleting any browser history. And it's really good for corporate compliance. And we'll talk a little bit about how all that works um, in another video. But let's move on to uh, the next room here, which is our medium-sized boardroom. Uh, this is a very common conference room style uh, that's a little bit longer than it is wide. And it's perfect for our Team Plus kit. And our Team Plus kit, I will take us to in a second here. Um, let's go ahead and take a quick look at our Team Plus kit here. Um, as you can see, very fast and affordable, easy to install. Just a, under 3000 for MSRP here. 10x camera, beam forming microphone, this quick launch software that we talked about that's super nice, and then uh, everything you need, keyboard and mouse, wall mount, and then the super fast Intel Nook. So as we were looking at this standard style boardroom here, you can see that um, it, it fits, it's going to fit well because it's a 10x camera. This is really, this is really uh, fits well with the field of view. Uh, which you can use our room design tool on our website to really check out. But the beauty of this system in particular is that everything is on the wall. Again, there's no cables draping over the floor for people to trip over, stomp on, pull out of their places. It's, this is a system that's going to last a long time. And most of the products in here have a two-year warranty. Uh, in fact, the Nook, I believe, has a three-year warranty. And let's take a closer look at this Nook again because it is the heart of the system. Again, we're just plugging HDMI into the display. We're using network. Oh, lost my Nook there. Where is it? Back to there. There's my Nook. Um, USB 3.0 for the camera. This is a little bit higher end than our normal team kit. Um, network. We highly suggest a hardwired network connection there for um, connectivity. And then HDMI to the display. Now, in the next system, we will show dual display, which this is capable of dual display. Um, with that DVI output, or sorry, that um, 
display port output there. And then as you can see, just everything on the wall couldn't be simpler. Here's our beam forming microphone array here, which is great pickup for rooms like this of the 20 to 30 feet wide style areas. And uh, zoom into the back of this, I'll show you where that USB 2.0 um, port is there. And that would just drape down the back, completely hidden uh, nicely, and that would allow us to um, go ahead and plug right into the Intel Nook as well. So you can see it as very easily is going to pick up the whole conference room table with, with high quality beam forming microphone array. And um, I'm going to go ahead and show you how this system is fully installed as well. So here we are with our, our second installation video. Uh, again, I just want to show like real world installation and then 3D uh, drawings as well. And again, these 3D drawings, we have all of them available. We have our products. We can help you create your own custom 3D drawings. Just let us know. Um, we're plugging in USB 3.0 to the camera there. Same installation for that Intel Nook. Get it right on the wall. He's got another USB 2.0, and I, I believe that is an HDMI for the display there. And what he's going to do is he's going to install the, uh, there's a little wall mount for that Acoustic Magic beam forming microphone array on the top of the display. You have two options here. You can mount it to the wall, which Robert's going to do because that is the most secure possible way of doing things or you can actually use included velcro and velcro it to the top of the display because it is a very light piece of hardware it's not uh, doesn't need any su uh, super secure mounting for this device so you can see here he's going to plug it into that usb 2.0 port that we looked at slip it down the back and plug that into the intel nook as well this is usb based cloud based video conferencing this will work with any web conferencing software so it's all USB. It's all selectable in your favorite web conferencing space. So he's spending a little extra time here just to tidy up the cables and everything, put the display on the wall, and that really um, is it. Um, if you really wanted to do it nicely, you could actually run that USB cable through the wall. Um, we've had some customers do that as well. So that wraps up our, our standard conference room. It's just so elegant and easy because it's all on the wall. Now let's look at a dual display in a slightly larger room um, and again if you if you have a, a custom room or something you want us to look at we can do a 3D layout um, to make sure it's just right for your your room specifically uh, but here it is here and now we're taking advantage of the dual video outputs on our Intel Nook. So the Intel Nook is, uh, should probably be located in the center there to, to easily, easily um, distribute video to both those displays. But we're just assuming that you know, the included, I believe it is a six to eight foot HDMI cable is gonna get you to where you need to go. Uh, we've looked at this Nook a couple times here. Very easily wall mounted there. Um, right behind the display for easy access to the power on and off button. Um, here's the 10x and of course Huddlecam offers larger cameras with more optical zoom on the uh, 20x and 30x models if you have a really big room. Um, so you can see here that this camera particularly is going to get a nice view uh, of the whole conference room and um, we can actually do field of view calculations as well if you really want to take a look at that. Um, so there it is there. We got our beam forming microphone up top there. And uh, you know, we looked at that again earlier, but uh, this time we are Velcroing it right to the top of those displays. And zoom into that little USB, it's a micro USB cable there. And then you can see that it has a very nice angle to pick up everyone in those, t in those chairs at your boardroom table. A very nice way of doing things. Um, that is really um, our three our three scenarios that we wanted to look at today. So you saw how to install these kits. You saw um, quite a few different ways on um, laying different rooms out, and uh, I do think that these are these are quite standard rooms that we we come into a lot. So we thought it would be a good idea to go ahead and show those. 
Um, if you have any questions, go ahead and let us know in the chat and I can answer them for you. But that's a brief overview of video conferencing installation in the three main rooms, those small, medium, and large rooms. Of course, there's different rooms. There's auditoriums. There's other rooms. Um, what I would say is reach out to us and ask us to help you with a 3D rendering of your next uh, project, and we would be happy to do that. We can also give you the Google SketchUp um, templates so that you can go ahead and build your own or work with one of our partners on a great uh, project. Thanks for watching, everybody. That's our show. Take care.